All right, friends, four easy steps, and we'll have our Yellowstone AI wireless trail camera set up and ready to send pictures. But first, let's see what's in the box. Welcome card with a quick start guide, and a user manual that no one ever reads. We've got our camera, mounting strap, two antennas, and a USB cable for connecting our camera to our computer to view pictures. We'll start by visiting my.yellowstone.ai and creating an account. Next, we'll click Activate New Camera. We'll name our camera and enter our ICC ID number, which is found on the sticker inside your camera. Then we'll pick a data plan and activate. All right, here's our camera and our data plan. We can see our monthly usage. After our picture comes in, we'll also see battery level and signal strength. We have options to manage the camera's data plan, as well as set up email notifications, update camera settings, and request a quick picture instantly. The best way to receive pictures from your camera is with the Yellowstone AI mobile app. You can download our app by searching for Yellowstone.ai Command Center in your App Store or Google Play Store. Then log in with the same email and password that you just used when activating your camera. On the Cameras page of our app, you can monitor all of your cameras and activate future cameras. You can then click on any camera to turn on app notifications, which will alert you every time a picture gets sent to your phone, you can also rename your camera, update your data plan, and update your camera settings. The media page allows you to view all your pictures and videos that your camera has sent. By pressing the select button, you can easily select one or more pictures to delete. Simply click any picture to zoom in and share with friends. All right, back at the camera, we have our batteries installed, we have our antennas mounted, our SD card, and our SIM card is right here. Don't remove the SIM card. Your camera will only work with the SIM card that comes installed in it. Once we're all set here, we'll slide the camera to setup mode. Your screen will light up, and the camera will begin searching for cell signal. After your camera finds cell signal, it'll show sync server time followed by GPS searching. After GPS searching goes away, we can press the circular OK button to take and send a test picture. The camera will display sending, then send succeed. Shortly thereafter, you'll receive your test picture on your phone. All right, now we're ready to mount our camera. We'll slide our camera up to on mode. The screen will go dark, that's normal. This red light will blink a couple times, then turn off. And then within about two minutes, your camera will be ready to begin detecting motion and taking pictures. And I'll leave you with a couple power tips. If you find that your AA batteries aren't lasting as long as you'd like, we have this optional solar panel and a 110 volt wall outlet plug. And as always, don't hesitate to call us if you have any questions. We are here to help. Thank you so much for watching and enjoy your new camera.